For a long time Zarathustra slept, and not only dawn passed over his face, but the morning too. At last, however, his eyes opened. Amazed, Zarathustra looked into the woods in the silence. Amazed, he looked into himself. Then he rose quickly like a seafarer who suddenly sees land again, jubilated, for he saw a new truth. And thus he spoke to his heart. An insight has come to me. Companions I need, living ones, not dead companions and corpses whom I carry with myself wherever I want to. Living companions I need, who follow me because they want to follow themselves wherever I want. An insight has come to me. Let Zarathustra speak not to the people, but to companions. Zarathustra shall not become the shepherd and dog of a herd, to lure many away from the herd, for that I have come. The people in the herd shall be angry with me. Zarathustra wants to be called a robber by the shepherds. Shepherds, I say, but they call themselves the good and the just. Shepherds, I say, but they call themselves believers in the true faith. Behold the good and the just. Whom do they hate most? The man who breaks their tables of values, the breaker, the lawbreaker. Yet he is the creator. Behold the believers of all faiths. Whom do they hate most? The man who breaks their tables of values, the breaker, the lawbreaker, and yet he is the creator. Companions the creator seeks, not corpses, not herds and believers. Fellow creators the creator seeks, those who write new values on new tables. Companions the creator seeks, and fellow harvesters, for everything about him is ripe for the harvest. But he lay, lacks a hundred sickles, so he plucks ears and is annoyed. Companions the creator seeks, and such as know how to wet their sickles. Destroyers they will be called, and despisers of good and evil, but they are the harvesters and those who celebrate. Fellow creators Zarathustra seeks, fellow harvesters and fellow celebrants. What are herds and shepherds and corpses to him? And you, my first companion, farewell. I buried you well in your hollow tree. I have hidden you well from the wolves, but I part from you. The time is up. Between dawn and dawn, a new truth has come to me. No shepherd shall I be, nor grave digger. Never again shall I speak to the people. For the last time have I spoken to the dead. I shall join the creators, the harvesters, the celebrants. I shall show them the rainbow and all the steps to the overman. To the hermit I shall sing my song to the lonesome and the twosome, and whoever still has ears for the unheard of. His heart shall become heavy with my happiness. To my goal I will go, on my own way. Over those who hesitate and lag behind shall I leap. Thus let my going be their going under.